The movie starts off with this dude named Mark hanging out with his buddies at a party. After the party, he goes to a room to hook up with a girl, but she turns him down. So he quietly heads home, watches Mia Khalifa documentaries on his computer, and crashes for the night. The next morning, his mom wakes him up and tells him his uncle is coming over, so he needs to get up early. Then Mark's uncle, along with his wife, Gina from Russia, show up. They have dinner together, and Mark can't help but notice Gina's bra. After dinner, Mark's mom mentions that Gina is going to Russia to pick up her 14-year-old daughter. A few days later, they all go to the airport to pick up Gina and her daughter, Natasha. When they arrive, Mark meets Natasha for the first time. Soon after, Mark's uncle ends up marrying Gina. After the wedding, they have a big party at the house and Mark can't take his eyes off Natasha. Later, he takes Natasha to his room and she asks him what he usually does in there. Mark tells her he plays video games and studies. Natasha then drops a bombshell saying she's already been with over 100 people and offers to do it with Mark. Mark reminds her that she's his cousin due to her mom marrying his uncle. But Natasha doesn't care and reveals her mom has been with other people too. Mark is left speechless. One day, Mark's mom tells him Natasha is new in town and doesn't have any friends, so he needs to spend more time with her. The next day, he goes to Natasha's place, but she's angry at her mom and storms off. Natasha tells Mark she despises her mother. Mark introduces Natasha to his friend Rufus, who lives alone since his parents are out of town. They go out to eat together and later Mark and Natasha take a bike ride. During a study session at Mark's place, Natasha sees Mark giving drugs to his friends. She asks for some and they end up taking it together. Natasha then asks to use Mark's laptop and finds adult videos, which they watch together. When she shows him her private photos on Facebook, things heat up and they end up making love. They start to like each other more and spend a lot of time together, getting intimate multiple times a day. Slowly, Mark starts to develop feelings for Natasha. One day, Mark's uncle and Natasha's mom go on a trip, leaving Natasha with Mark. They have a heart-to-heart, -heart, and Natasha expresses her desire to stay with Mark forever. She reveals her mother is cheating on his uncle with another man, and though Natasha told him, he didn't believe her. When the uncle and Natasha's mom return, Natasha's mom wants her to come home, but Natasha chooses to stay with Mark instead. Her mother tells her, I know why you don't want to go, Beta. I know all the Harkatine you're doing with Mark. But Mark's father stops her from saying more. The next day, Mark goes to meet Natasha at her house, and her mother starts giving him an earful. You're this Nalayak Beti. Her habits are so Gandhi. She slams the door shut and tells Mark to get lost. Later, Natasha lands up at Mark's house with all her Saman. She tells him, I'm going back to Russia. Will you come with me? Mark is chub, doesn't say a word. Then Natasha drops a bomb. My mother divorced your uncle because she caught us sleeping together. Mark is heartbroken, Yar. He's totally gone for Natasha. He takes her to his room to stay for the night. In the morning, Mark gives Natasha some paisa for her journey. Natasha quietly takes her things and leaves. At Mark's house, everyone is gossiping about his uncle's divorce. Mark knew the whole sack, but kept his mouth shut. A few days go by, and Mark's friend Rufus keeps calling him, but he doesn't pick up. One day, Mark goes to Rufus's house and is shocked to see Natasha there. She's living with him now. Rufus tells him, Yar, I called you so many times to tell you about Natasha, but you didn't answer. Mark gives Natasha a look that could burn holes through her. He realizes their whole love story was a big mazak, a joke he gets on his bike and zooms off, fuming with anger. Natasha just stares after him, her face unreadable.